This is the plaintiff, Vanessa Dawson. She says the defendants, her son and his wife, stole her shopping cart, won't return it, and she has no other choice but to sue. Son or no son, she's suing for the $59.87 today, and she wants it so she can go buy herself a new cart. These are the defendants, Marcus Dawson and Sabrina Thompson. Marcus says this whole thing's a bit ridiculous, but you know how it goes. Sometimes the mother is jealous of the wife. They didn't steal a shopping cart. They have no need for a shopping cart. And he's sorry to say this, but his mother is crazy. They're accused of not treating mommy dearest. All parties, please raise your right hands. Welcome back to the People's Court. Next case on the docket, the plaintiff is suing her son and his wife for right. stealing her shopping cart. But the defendant says it all boils down to the fact that the plaintiff is jealous of her son's wife. It's the case of not treating mommy dearest. Vanessa Dawson, you yes. are suing Marcus Dawson and Sabrina Thompson, your son and his girlfriend or yes. wife? wife? Girlfriend or wife? wife. Are you married or aren't you? No. Then you're not his wife, you're his girlfriend, okay. Uh, for $59.87 because they took your shopping cart. Yes. All right, tell me what happened. Okay, on um, March 15th, she came to the house with Marcus and she told Marcus that, um, Marcus called me and told me that somebody was behind him. Some, some guys was gonna, came to his house to I'm sorry, arrest I'm, him. That Marcus called you and told you? that some boys, some guys came to his apartment with guns. So I told him he could come to my house. He could, he Why would me. people come to his apartment with guns? I don't know. He oh, you didn't ask? Said, You're his mother. Yes, I asked him and he said, um, the, the, his, lord, his landlord sent the guys here or something. Okay. Because he was having problems with the landlord. Okay. And um, I told him he could come there, but I don't want her in my How house. How long have they been together? I don't Four know. years. Four years, and you don't get along with her? No. Why not? She's she she's a user, just like Mark, my son is. Okay. That's a lie. Okay, hold on one second. Let me first hear from her, and then I'll hear from you guys. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead. He's a she's a user, like my son is. What okay. have okay. I used you for? What is part of what I just yeah, said yeah. did you not understand? Well, uh, you're um, not in your. Hold listen hold to me. Hold, hold, hold. You're not in your house. You're in my courtroom. So we have an order to things. I just said that not understood. ten seconds ago. Understood. Go ahead. Well, no, is it understood this time? Because it was, apparently wasn't understood the first time. Go ahead. So okay, one day I had I, I was going to Dialis. Instead of they come and pick up her, her little daughter, she um she is that about your grandchild or not your grandchild? No, it's okay. not my yes, grandchild. It is. I did a favor okay. for her. That's three. Have a seat, and when it's your turn, I'll bring you up. Go ahead and have a seat, please. Go ahead. So instead of they come and pick up the child, I had to wait. I had to miss my turn of dialysis. Okay, that, that's, that's kind of really serious to miss a dialysis. My father was on dialysis for four years. That's really serious to miss a dialysis. But, I, but he shows, excuse me. She, he shows the attitude that he don't care. Okay, but here's what I don't understand. The child was at your house and no yeah. one else was? No. Were you watching the child? Yes, I was watching the child for And her. what time was someone supposed to be there? I was supposed to be at dialysis, at dialysis at five o'clock. Had you told they him come, that? Yes. All right, so then when did she end up coming? Her um, walkers came together. When? About after six o'clock. Okay. It was after six. They right. came. So you ended six. up missing it, dialysis. Yes. Okay. Did you make up the dialysis? Yes. The when lady let me make it up. So that that causes a fight between you folks. And what happens? She came to my house. She told um, Marcus that I hit her. I did not hit her. Me and Marcus was in the hallway arguing because when I had told Marcus about the people that he when he told me about the people coming to him with guns and stuff like that. I told Marcus he could come into my house and stay until everything settled. And so when what happened, when Marcus came, Marcus and her walking around my apartment whispering. I asked him what they was whispering about. Marcus never told me. So I said, you know what? Instead, of I have to, you know, go through all of this about y'all coming in my apartment whispering. Y'all could go back out. I don't need y'all here. And I let them go. Okay. 
And then what happened? And they, that's when she told me that she was going to go downstairs and call the cops, holler about mm -hmm. I hit her. If I wanted to hit her, I wouldn't have hit her. I would have knocked her out. Okay. Um, we're, you can come on up. We're, I, I take it that the beginning part of this happens without Marcus there? Um, about Dallas's, that never happened. Yes, it did no, happen. No, no, no. I'm sorry. She's describing an incident where you guys got there late and she had to go late to dialysis. No, Are that, you saying that never happened? That never happened. All right, tell me what yes. happened in March, though. My landlord was overcharging me on a rent-subsidized building. Okay. He owed me $12,000 now. He's upset. He hired some bums to come inside the, uh, a vacant apartment. Vacant to, apartment? Uh, yeah, an uh, empty apartment. Downstairs. Upstairs. He moved them upstairs to harass me out the building because the rent goes down now. So I'm going through, her, uh, through a surgery trying to re repair How my How were they hernia. harassing you? How was they harassing me? Uh, every time they see me, they call the police. Mm -hmm. Saying every what? Um, that I, I'm harassing them, that I pulled out guns, I pulled out a knife. Yeah. So every time so they see- Did you see, end up getting arrested? Like two different occasions. Okay. So b before I got- So I, you decide you have to get out of there, mm -hmm. and then where and do so you go? I, I call my mother. I tell her um, I need to a, a place for me and my family to lay low so until I'm done with my surgery. So I called well, her. Uh, can I ask what the surgery was? Um, to repair a hernia. Okay. So I called her, and the uh, uh, the the drama with her it occurred when she fixed some some um, some patty cakes and for mm -hmm. us to eat, and we didn't want to eat it because we didn't know whether like we eating rices or roaches. You know what I mean? Well, that's so, kind of rude of somebody. Yeah, like she keeps her place nasty. That's what we was whispering well, why, about okay, to clean up. Okay, but that's kind of rude considering that you're a guest in her house. Yeah, but this is my mother, so I'm. Then a, don't go there. Go somewhere else when you need so yeah, you, when you need hiding. Don't I, go to. I, I, I to understand, her place. but this since this is my mother, and I see an issue, I take care of it. I don't complain about okay, it. Okay, well, let me tell you what taking care of it would be would be not whispering to each other about it, like and and you know insulting her. But in any not, event, no. tell me about. I want to hear what happened. Got, so so can I, can there's I say a fight. Something? Tell, let, you tell me first. You're the person who got okay. hit, right? Um, okay. So we went to go do laundry. Right. And I said, you really have to talk to your mom because she had hit me in the head this morning. With the, and the neighbor was there. Okay. So How did she hit you in the head? She, like, slapped me in the back. Like, Harder. Yeah. I mean, it's annoying no matter what. I'm not believing it. I, I just... was shocked, though. <laughs> okay. And the neighbor said, what is wrong with you? Why did you hit the girl? She didn't do anything. She's like, I can't stand her. And he was like, what? So he called her and said, Ma. What's okay, going you tell on? me about your yeah. conversation with your mother. I called her uh, and, and no, she called me complaining about yeah. a plant. She told me to scoot the plant over a little bit, but I didn't want to scoot the plant over. I wanted to put it in sunlight so it can grow. And um, she calls me flipping about it. And then I'm like, she flipping about a plant, but she's slapping her. So I'm like, Betty, it's time for me to go. She, she agreed. So. We go back home and that be that. Yeah. And in the midst of us going home, we were she slaps her. I hold her that. And I, I, and Wait, I, and how did she slap her? Slap she, her no, no, she didn't slap her. <laughs> but she didn't, she didn't slap me. her. She poked her in the she eye. Like went to she poked in the eye. Now, me? now. No, we, wait. I need. To, I, I do need to understand what you're saying because I'm. I'm not. What do you mean she poked she, her in she, the eye? She, you know, ghetto like. She went to yeah. Like, okay, like that, but did her finger make contact? Yes, yes it she did. actually Where? hit me in Where? my in my um. In, in your in eye? In my eye, yeah. Did you seek medical attention? Yes, I did. Yes. And, do and you I made proof? her call the police. I have um, documentation of the police report. And okay, I have, did you seek medical attention? Yes. They do you have proof EMT. that you sought medical attention? Oh, you mean the, the, the emergency, emergency there, yeah. showed up? They just said that my eye looked scratched and to put... Do you um, have pictures cold. of a scratched eye? No. Okay, so you called the police on her. No, well, he called and then after. Yeah, I, I, I dialed the number and I put her on the phone. Because we adults and adults don't suppose. I know to be adults don't go to their mother's house either. You know your mother. Your mother yeah, well, didn't. Well, your own, mother did not become who place. she is today overnight. So you call the police and your mother ends up in jail overnight. Yeah, so you like, end up in jail overnight. What happened to that case? Um, so I have order protection on her, and um, she had violated protection by calling me again. Like she called you. Yeah. 
So she got arrested again? Yeah. You called the cops and told them she violated the order of protection and called me. No, So she could have been arrested twice. No, I didn't call the cops. Tell um, me about the shopping cart. Where's the shopping yes. cart? I don't know nothing about we no didn't shopping cart. No, it's not a shopping cart. She yes. accused us of stealing the shopping cart. So we and bought one. We bought one. And oh, then afterwards. To, yes. to alleviate the situation. The problem. We took it to the precinct. I bought. I brought the receipt. I gave it to them. Um, they went to give it to her, and she said that she kicked the car or flung the car, and said, this is not my car. I know it's not your car because we didn't take a car. Is it the same as the one she had? We don't know. I don't know. I never seen a car. You never saw a car. No, a we car. did not see a car there. What is it you're missing, ma'am? Okay, I have the receipt from my shopping cart where I brought it from. Okay. As for my place, my place is not nasty. I Talk to me, my not house. to anybody else. Go ahead. I clean my house. They are not allowed to come in my house for stealing. It's not only the shopping cart they stole out of my house. They stole food and all when I got arrested. The people downstairs, here go the letter. The people downstairs, and here, here go the thing bomb that I took out on him for the shopping cart. Meat. Uh, Meat. Who's James Morrison? That's a friend of mine. Who's James Morrison? Do you guys know? know? That's a friend I don't of mine. I heard you the first time. I was oh, asking them if they know who he is, because this is just writing on a piece of paper. According to this neighbor, he says that he saw you folks walk in and took items from there that did not belong to you, a $54 shopping cart, cellular phone equipment, Sells canned me. food, and various other missing items. I don't even know this person. Do you know a neighbor? No, I'm not How even about from that the neighbor area. you said was in the house. James Morrison it lives with her. That's right. Oh. Lives with her. That's, she that's knew, crazy. She knew. I said neighbor. I, I know him as she crazy. Knew who he is. She know who he is. Okay, so he lives with her. Who is he? Boyfriend. On March 23rd. When did the arrest take place? March 15th? Yes. yes. And on March 23rd, you charge your son with stealing the cart, or actually there's an incident report about it. Did yes. you ever get arrested for it? No. No. They, cause they bought a cart. So they bought a cart and brought it to the police station? With the receipt, yes. Okay, yes. and when the police handed you the cart, what did you do? No, she had brought a small cart. This cart that I had bought didn't look like that cart. What did the there? cart you, you bought look like? I sent the pitch up there. That's what the cart looked like. What did yes. she buy? Do you have a picture of what she you had? No, the police little, have it. I can't. I, pick that cart. I went to the precinct yesterday to get a picture or something, and they said we can't do that because it's in the back and it's like evidence. Or something. I mean, you know, you want me to look at her and say she's crazy. They would never harm her like that, except for that I have this one major glaring problem, which is that you got her arrested for doing this, so you might do something. Like, you understand what I'm saying? Like, if I have somebody who's really angry and you want, you know, that side says, look, this didn't happen, you know, you know they, they're, they're, they're trying to calm things down. That's fine, except for that I don't have that situation. I have people having absolutely no problem saying things like, "My, we don't know if it's roaches, and you're getting your mother arrested and having her spend a night in jail, and, you know, it's fine, you just can't have your cake and eat it, too. You can't make it look like you're calming everything when you weren't. You had her spend a night in jail. So is it that crazy that you might take something that she relies on? I don't know. Maybe you, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. No, but with the time she leaped at me to attack me, the reason why I went like this instead of a punch or a slap is because Marcus and the neighbor jumped in. My neighbor, they, they didn't see that, see that I yeah, hit her. But the, but the boyfriend who you live her. with did, it would be really good to have your boyfriend here today. I have a recording saying that she did hit me. We have a recording from uh, her. Not, excuse me. That what? Hold on. That what? That she that left she on a recorder? Attacked me. Yes, ma'am. That she left on a recorder. Play, she left on my play phone. Play the music. So do mothers typically get jealous of their son's wives? What do you think? I plead the fifth. This is my wife. <laughs> Interesting. What do you think? Yes. So your mom is jealous. His mom. Oh, his, his mom is jealous Not of Not of me, but the other two sister-in-laws. Yeah. She gets along with you? Yes. Oh, cool. I'm okay. Cool. You're the favorite? Uh, okay, even though, you, even though you inflate car estimates. Right, Gotcha. Right, right. Okay, what do you say? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think uh, it's, it's kind of like uh, giving your son away to another woman. Yeah. Okay, that's fair enough. And does that create bad blood? It could, yeah. Does it generally? <laughs> yes. You don't have to be so scared of me. <laughs> Going inside the courtroom.
You can take it off. You can take it off. So, do you have a, 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 you don't have a picture of the new cart. You have a picture of the old cart. But now I'm having a little bit of a problem with your credibility, too, because you told me they made up lies about having it. And I hear you on the recorder they, saying, they hey, I hit that beat to lies. get her out of my way. She was in my way. I mean, um, so, you know, they they brought a cart to the police station. I By the way, it. did you say you had a receipt for your cart? Yes. Let me see the receipt for your cart. That's this? Yes. That's the same, it's the oh, same, same exact cart. Wait, yes. let me see the receipt for your cart. I don't have... Um, I bought mine. How much did you spend on it? It was like sixteen ninety nine plus tax. No. Six nine. Sixteen ninety nine plus. Sixteen ninety nine. No, she yes. had a fifty nine dollar cart. And that's the one that they yeah. got. Hold on one second. Wait a minute. Is this their cart? No, that's my cart. I paid for that cart. They didn't buy. Did they not buy no cart? Okay, but when me. did you pay for the? This is the I receipt for, for the that, cart that was missing. Did, yeah, that's the cart that's missing. This is a cart that's missing? Yes. That's interesting because the and date because on the it guy, is 4 6 2015, which is after the, all this happened. I had went to exactly. the lady. Yeah, then this isn't the, the receipt cart. for the one that's missing. I had went to the I lady. I find that the proof is insufficient and I rule in favor of the defendants. I don't want you smiling because there's nothing happy mm. about the fact that I just ruled for you. Yes. This is sad. It is. Yes. It's sad. Yes. Okay? Well, you might as well consider me dead because I don't want to have nothing to do with you. Wait, I don't want to have nothing to do with you. What are you saying to them as, as you're leaving the courtroom? What I say to them? Yeah. He's dead to me. Why would you say that about you? I don't want to have nothing to do with him. What do you have against her? What I have against her? She, she don't mean nothing to me. I don't even like her. But him, he, he might as well consider me dead, too. That's your son. I don't care. I really don't care. No, come on, okay. All right. Okay, so step on in here. Uh, that has to be painful to, to hear. Yeah, it is. I mean, I could have gave her $60. Exactly. I, I'm a working well, man. Well, it's not about a shopping cart, obviously. Yeah, she's personal vendetta. Um, I just heard in the courtroom it had to do with her missing a medical like um, dialysis, which never happened. Um, I, I, I was about. nothing but helpful to that woman when she was sick and she had surgery. I took off my days of work. I was working. Yeah, but that's this is his mom. Yeah, I understand about. that. Yeah. You know, you only have one, and mm -hmm. you're a son, and uh, so how can it be like this? Um, because I come from a dysfunctional family. He it is been, what it he's is. He's been a good son. But to I'm her. good. I'm he's good. He's been a good son to her. Okay. All right. The best. Thank you. Okay, Thank Harvey. You guys. Okay, just uh, my advice here, maybe this is one where the wife wants to tone it down a bit and let uh, her husband repair the relationship. And that will do it for this case. Litigants, for the next case of the way into the courtroom, right now.